This is the Ram motorcycle camera mount. It uh, attaches to the handlebar with the U clamp and then it's got universal joints you can use to put it in whatever position you want. And the, on the top, there's a standard uh, threaded camera mount that fits your standard camera. So basically what you do is you take your video camera, put the threaded screw in the hole, and then twist it. Now your camera might not be pointing where you want it to, but because this is a ball joint, you just swivel it to whatever position you want it in, and then lock it down with this, with this thumb screw here. Let's see if I can get you a better angle of that. So this thumb screw clamps these two parts down on these ball and socket joints and then you can move the camera pointing whichever way you want. If you wanted to point it towards yourself or point it towards towards uh, the road ahead of you or even point it at your front wheel. I'll try a few shots and you'll see what it looks like. Um, on this particular motorcycle there's a lot of vibration at idle so it's a Harley. So it's got the rubber mounted engine so on the freeway it's pretty smooth but when it's idling or when the engine's at lower revs it really jumps around i'll show you an example of that in here too and it, the way it connects to the handlebar here is just a simple u-joint so it's just a, a u-clamp that goes under the handlebar and is bolted onto here which means you could anywhere that you have a tube that's one inch diameter on your bike you could clamp it on there rather than on the handlebar if you wanted to overall it's a pretty good uh, pretty good camera mount though I found that mounting the camera to your body insulates you from vibration better than just about anything else so here's a few test shots that I shot with it I'll be using a, a GoPro on it for the test shots now if you want to use a GoPro with a standard uh, tripod threaded screw hole you have to buy this adapter uh, GoPro sells them and there's also people on eBay that sell a sort of a pirate version that's probably not as good but it's about 12 bucks so let's see how it works on the shaky handlebars of my Harley with this GoPro camera shooting video that's a lot of vibration not bad when you rev it up though. 